today's full moon is a spacey lunar eclipse in Sagittarius. It's Saturday, May 25th, and I'm Jeff Jower for Planet Pulse. And I'm Rick Levine. It sounds odd to say that an eclipse is spacey, because normally eclipses focus the energy before they spin it around a few times. Exactly. And yet, you're right, Jeff, today's um, full moon in Sagittarius is a lunar eclipse, and it is square to nebulous Neptune in spaced-out Pisces. And so I think maybe it's not just that it's a spacey lunar eclipse. I think maybe we struggle with the differentiation between the part of us that's drawn toward escape or spacing out and the part that really realizes that there's real stuff going on and there's no room for spacing out. We need to pay attention to it. Well, that's not coming from... From the eclipse. There's no. nothing very real about the eclipse because the Sagittarius moon wants to shoot off in new directions. Agreed. The sun opposing it in Gemini is jittery. And Neptune square to the eclipse certainly makes it spacey, but you're right, there's something else which is nailing at least one foot to the ground today. Yeah, and I think both feet are nailed to the <laughs> ground. But but the thing that we're talking about is that Mars in in stabilizing Taurus is forming a square and a half, a sesquisquare with Pluto. Mars and Pluto are tough characters. Mars is the god of war, and Pluto is the one planet that can beat Mars to crap. <laughs> <laughs> or and, any planet. Or yeah. any planet. And so when these two planets planets are in a stressful aspect, it really can raise tough issues of manipulation, power, control. And Pluto's got its own story cooking with it squared to Uranus, which has been going all week. This is a rough week in the eclipse, even though it's spacey, I think releases a lot of that energy. Well, we have this enormous contrast between the struggle or the need to fight of Mars-Pluto and the spiritual let's let it go with, uh, with the open-minded moon in Sagittarius, knowing where to take a stand and where to let go, I think is the big challenge of the day. I'm Jeff Jower. And I'm Rick Levine, inviting you to join Jeff and me here on Planet Pulse every day.